Okay, so let's um, update everyone on what the heck's been going on here. This has been running off of battery, first of all, for two days. So um, I think the, uh, the juice in this is going to be sufficient to power the microcontrollers and a pair of these for an evening. <clears throat> I'll just have to do a test. But um, uh, this is really a, um energy-efficient little job here. This is a high-density <clears throat> piece of um, uh, energy storage. All right. So, so far, so good. Now, this thing. Um, I have got its limit switches um, working. And I've got it hooked up to the PIR sensor, the passive IR sensor. And it um, manages to trigger movement of the... Um, carriage, um, when it senses movement, pops up to the top, and it uses the Adafruit sound library and a little amplifier in order to produce sound by the, the speakers. Go away. Go. I see you. Just go. And then it pops back down. And I've got a number of different samples in there. Why have you woken me from my slumber? then you can, and it selects from them uh, randomly. That candy's gonna rot your teeth. Have more. Now, that one's timing is a bit off. I don't understand what's going on there, but we'll have to fix that. And there's one more sample that in there. That candy's gonna rot your teeth. Have more. But um, I can't quite get to that sample. Only 61 more days to do your Christmas shopping. Okay, so now <clears throat> all we need to do is to um, mount the, get the other one of these working, mount a stick on here so that it pops, um, pops the, uh, no, whoops. Why have you woken me from, from my, my slumber? slumber? Yeah, okay. During testing, that gets old. But anyways, we just need to mount this on, on a stick so that it pops up and then figure out what we're going to actually mount it into. Um, and then neaten up these wirings because that's not going to last. So I'm going to have to, um, I don't know, figure out a way of... Um, I don't know. I really don't know how I'm going to do that um, in terms of making it a little more robust. Unless I use some hot glue on here. Only 61 yeah. more days to do your Christmas shopping! Um, hot glue on here to keep them um, in position and just, you know, schmoo it up so that I can actually take the schmoo off later. And then I have to figure out an extension and figure out how long this is. But it seems like it's got a reasonable um, sensor range, you know, on the order of a few feet. So, yeah, I think that that is going to um, work out. Anyways, um, stay tuned for the uh, remainder of the uh, Mechatronics build. That'll come probably tomorrow or so. And uh, as always, thanks for watching. Bye for now.